In this video, we're looking at construction 18, which is asking us to construct an angle of 60 degrees without using a protractor or without using our set square. In order to construct the angle of 60 degrees, we're going to use our compass and we're going to use our knowledge of equilateral triangles. Remember that an equilateral triangle is a triangle with three equal sides and all angles must be equal to each other, which means they must be 60 degrees. So we're basically going to draw an equilateral triangle. Now, what the first step we're going to do here is we're going to draw the baseline here and you can pick the length of that baseline. It doesn't matter what length you, you make it. I'm going to work to five centimeters here. So I'm basically drawing a triangle with three sides of five centimeters, but you can pick any length. So I'm going to use my ruler now and draw a line segment of five centimeters. So I'm starting at zero and drawing a line to five. I'm going to put a dot at both ends of my line segment to denote that it's a segment. So it starts at a point and ends at a point and it's starting at A and I'm going to say it finishes at B. You can call them X and Y or whatever letters you commonly use. I'm now going to use my compass and I'm going to measure the length of that line, which we know is now five centimeters. And I'm going to draw the other two sides of my triangle of five centimeters. Again, making that equilateral triangle. So I'm taking my ruler out again and I'm just going to pull it aside here and I'm going to use my compass and I'm going to set the needle of my compass to zero and I'm going to set my pencil now to five. So again, it's going to be the same length as the line segment and I'm going to just get rid of my ruler here and I'm going to double check it. I'm just going to put my compass against my line segment and you can see here that it is five centimeters. So what I'm going to do is basically draw an arc. An arc is part of a circle. So I'm bringing up my compass. So around here would work for me. So I'm making a triangle out of it. So I'm drawing my arc. I think that should be enough. And then I'm going to move my knee needle over to B and I'm going to do the same. And hopefully the two arcs will intersect each other. So it looks like I just have to move my other arc ever so slightly. So it's good practice here because this happens in reality. So you can see here that they're not intersecting. So I'm bringing my needle back over to A and I'm going to come back around here and make those arcs intersect. So there you can see that they're intersecting. So I'm going to put away my compass so you can see that. So I now have my two arcs intersecting. I'm going to label that point C. So that's my third point in my triangle. So I'm putting a point on it to denote that that's my angle C. And now I'm going to connect A to C and B to C. So moving over my ruler, must go through A and must go through C. So that looks about right. And I'm going to connect them with a line. Now, I don't have to form the, the line segment from B to C because the question just wants us to construct an angle of 60 degrees. And that is technically what I've now done. This angle, angle A, is now 60 degrees. And the reason for it is that I've constructed a line segment of five centimeters and five centimeters. And if I was to connect the line from B to C, it would also be five centimeters. And that is construction 18. Thank you for watching another tutorial video from Tullamats. Make sure and subscribe.